Kind of weird working on a car that can talk back to you. But we'll get used to it. Of course. Let's see if we can find if what you want. Had a new engine. Uh, good point. Okay, get that thing out of here. I'll get the hose. Proper maintenance is so important. Somewhere beyond the sea, my love's waiting for me. Hey, it's the Rangers. Let me show you. Time to take some chances and expand man's horizons. I wonder if there will be conflict. There's no more exhilarating.
Colonel Death will be along just as soon as I make sure you're all here. And you haven't brought along any unexpected guests. Can't be too careful these days, right? Glad we have an understanding. Well, looks like everyone's here who's supposed to be here, so I'll give her a ring. All clear. Come ahead. <clears throat> Hey now, cowboys. Face to face at last. And just as handsome as I thought you'd be. Remember when you chose to follow the Patriarch's orders instead of saving those folks Erastus threatened to slaughter? I figured we'd meet here so you could see what was left of them. I know Woodson told you to do Buchanan's bidding, but to my mind, it ain't the Ranger way to help the powerful ahead of the helpless. Because things like this happen. Just something to keep in mind as you hear me out. <laughs> Good eye, Doc. It's definitely put a hitch in my talk box. But no thank you. I got it under control. This and my fake leg are souvenirs from when my chopper got shot out of the sky over Long Beach, California. Good times. Uh, since you've obviously got the skills to use them, here, I got a few extra med kits on me. Try not to use them all at once. Well, ain't you polite. Hope that bodes well. Now what with you not taking Saul's sons out like I asked? I'm guessing we've got different ideas about how things in Colorado should play out. But I'm still hoping you'll come around, November. So here's the deal. As my friends and I see it, two things gotta happen to save the people of Colorado from tyranny and slaughter. First, Liberty and the gang she's gathered out east have to be eliminated. And second... Shit! Scar collectors. Well, well. Speak of the devil and her minions shall appear. Looks like Liberty overheard our rendezvous call. Guess we'll have to deal with this before we continue. Forward to death! That smote them. I got your back, Angie. I will take you down. Taken. Ready.
for pisses. Got my sights on their flanks. Forgive me. God protect me. Chase the plasma! Got around him. As my friends and I see it, two things gotta happen to save the people of Colorado from tyranny and slaughter. First, Liberty and the gang she's gathered out east have to be eliminated. Second, and you're gonna love this, the patriarchs gotta go too. I love the people of Arizona. Arizona is my home. But are you willing to save lives there at the expense of lives here? Are you okay sending home food spattered with innocent blood? The Rangers have fought tyranny since the beginning, without compromise. How can we continue to do that if we take handouts from a tyrant? How can we pretend we're heroes if we do his dirty work to get it? Sorry, I had this argument with General Woodson a hundred times. A sure deal was more important to him than a moral one. That's why the advance team went dark and decided to do this on our own. Of course, it turned out we couldn't do it on our own, which is why we were so happy when you showed up, and why we're here now, asking you for help. Oh, thanks for hearing me out. Uh, let's talk about Liberty first. I've got to hand it to her. Daddy's little girl has done the impossible. She's united the boldest and baddest warlords of the Eastern Plains, and she's getting ready to lead them into Colorado. When she does, well... <sighs> well, that'll be the end of this place. Every man, woman, and child from here to the Rockies will be killed, enslaved, or taken as a sacrifice, and their houses and towns burned to the ground. None of us want that, right? Oh, I don't mind about that. So long as you change your mind about him after. So? Glad to hear it. So here's the plan. Part one, help Ironclad Cordite take control of Liberty's gangs. Then, part two, let him lead them all off to Kansas, 
where he can achieve his blood-soaked destiny without getting any on us. I know you've got him on ice back at Ranger HQ. Well, it's time to dust him off and put him to good use. Now, I'm guessing y'all have some questions. Pete and Brother Thomas came back with me from L.A. and Tax from Arizona. These others are locals who have various gripes against the patriarch. We trained him up as best we could. Nicer bunch of folks you'll never find. Pretty simple, really. The Patriarch has spies watching Liberty's compound. If you show up, those spies will think you're there on Daddy's behalf, and they'll be happy to see you. If we show up, our plan is revealed, yeah? And that would give the Marshals a chance to button up Colorado Springs before we make our attack. They'd be waiting for us. <sighs> now that's gonna be a fight. Basically, while you're taking care of Liberty, my team will be in Colorado Springs, softening the ground. Once you finish up out there, you'll come back and help us corner the man and bring him down. Our primary concern, other than ending the bloody reign of the Buchanans, is minimizing civilian casualties. That means you've got to ride herd on your crew and watch who you ally yourself with. For instance, we don't want the gangs coming to the party. If Cordite wants to come along and get his revenge on the Patriarch, Fine, but he leaves his army at home, no matter how tight a hold he thinks he's got on him. We want to be the good guys here, so we've got to do this clean. Rape and pillage is a surefire way to turn people against their liberators. Keep the peace, keep things fair. I don't see the rangers running things. I see our job as keeping the playing field even. There's always a lot of weasels that come out of the woodwork after a big man falls, trying to grab a piece of the pie. So we're just going to hang around, and every time a weasel pops their head up, we'll whack them. At the same time, whenever somebody comes along who tries to take care of the people, all the people, we'll help them out. But we ain't going to be anybody's muscle. We'll answer to the people, nobody else. I doubt it's going to be nice, but it's got to be done. Well, for one thing, we ain't paying the man. We ain't actively funding murder the way old Saul is. And second, despite Cordite's destiny, my guess is he goes back to Kansas and him and his rivals all wipe each other out, leaving the whole territory a more peaceful place. All right, then. What's it gonna be? What? Oof, there's a load off my mind. Thank you. You're gonna make all the difference. Now here's the location of Liberty's camp. Be careful when you get close. The gangs don't care much for strangers, and even less for rangers. You mustn't do this, Rangers. Please. I am sympathetic to your cause, but I am still a loyal subject of the Patriarch. If you follow this path to its conclusion, I shall have no choice but to oppose you. Hmm. Good luck sorting it out, cowboys. We'll talk again when Liberty's taken care of. November, this is Ranger HQ. The Brainiacs in R&D just showed me some of the wild stuff they're done working on. You should come take a look when you're free. Over and out.
this place needs is a good sound system. Amen. I'm tired of listening to you two bitch and moon all the time. We gotta teach these rangers about good music. The songs of our people. Stay sharp. Stay sharp. Hey, Ranger Command. Powder or Glaze. What? Who is this? Jimmy at Iron Thunder Transport. We're bringing you your new water heater and we're getting donuts on the way, so powder or glaze. Clear the channel, Jimmy. This is emergency only. No nonsense. No. It's great to be now. What can I do for you? Safe travels, Rangers. Been seeing a chick now. What can I help you with? I'll be here. I understand you had a tough decision to make. Sure thing, let's have a look. There you go. Anything else? I'll be here. Good of you to help Flab keep good now. Sure thing. Let's have a look.
There you go. Anything else? I'll be here. Good to see Rook around. It's a shame about the Loka, though. the dance out of this piece of shit two days ago and now they bring it back with all new ones that's the job boyo steady work hey Here we get serve. paid the same no matter how many people right? another right day now. in paradise I marveled when you told me how You? But you live in a big city. And ask for... Back to the, uh... 
first we break out of these cells. What about it? Well, how do we do it? I'm working on that, but I've got the rest all figured out. I'm so fucking bored! What are you doing? The occupants of Colorado Springs are under our protection. <laughs> You're testing me, Rangers. Harm a non-combatant in Colorado. finds out you've put me in here, your head's going to be on the chopping block. Come on, Valor. <laughs> That's only because you've been lying what are you to doing? him about me. So mad at you when we get What are home. you doing? Turkey in the straw, like your life depended on it. I've never played a banjo in my life. Huh. Okay, new plan. <laughs> Rangers, I know I advocated for freeing that fellow we found locked up in here. Kind of having second thoughts now. Just something not right about him. Hope we won't regret it. Now. What can I do for you? Mama Cotter has been a little difficult. I'm not going to lie. I don't think I know anyone that uncompromising about their ideals. I don't even think she's that wrong. She just mm, went about it badly. Protecting and helping the weak and unfortunate? That is certainly a form of justice. <laughs> but she did break the law so, so, so many times, and would have undoubtedly continued. I fear the marshals would have killed her for that, regardless of her good intentions. Do you think we have the resources to build another, more secure cage for victory? I can feel him watching me, waiting for an opportunity. <sighs> He's a predator, and he sees everyone everything as his prey. I'm not sure anything can change that. Makes you see the reason why they built the pillories in the first place. But I've heard stories about how he'd watch them laughing as a child. Maybe that's where he got the idea that life is cheap and the rest of us are just for his amusement. I heard what Ash did. That's the banality of evil. The casual cruelty of the cowardly and sycophantic. He still says he was just doing what he was told, as he had no choice. 
no control over his actions. I'm not sure if he truly believes that or if he's just trying to protect himself. I'm not sure it matters. I think the only way we'll find true justice here is to give him the time to sit with his crimes and steep. Valor's an arrogant, condescending prig, but he hasn't given me any trouble. Hopefully, some time in here will help him reflect on his ways. Realize people aren't machines, toys for him to play with. If he could use his talents to better Colorado, maybe that would be justice for him. Good luck out there. Sorry, was that me? Oh, it kind of burns the eyes. Out. Damn hobo. If it was up to me, I'd be dead by now. Huh? Could have killed himself as a slave. Hey, now, what's coming out of your mouth is worse than what's coming out of my ass. You better check yourself. It's only because I check myself every day that you are dead. And you had a tough decision to make between sure thing let's have a look Drunk. Both, Scotch Mo. I am green, and you are drunk. W when, when did you turn green? I've been green for as long as you've known me. There you go. Anything else? I'll be here. People are talking about how you cleared those Dorseys out of sure thing. Let's have a look. Anything else? I'll be here. Now, sure thing. Let's have a look. There you go. Sure thing. Let's have a look. There you go. Anything else? I'll be here.
Hope fighting the Gippers doesn't bite us in the ass. They were nuts, but nobody else knows how to refine oil. Those troublemakers gotta go. I'm pleased you were able to rescue some of your comrades in Aspen. Time to take some chances and expand man's horizons. I wonder if there will be conflict. Springs any day now. A little trading with you would. Thanks, Rangers. We won't let the others talk you down. Oh, thank you. It ain't much. Much obliged if you came by. Rangers, you came! We're in dire straits here. Those twisted psychopaths want us all dead. You gotta help us. Them crazies were demanding our bison to turn him into weapons of war. Sick fucks wanted to graft machine parts onto them or something. When they started machining them up, the bison fought back. They don't like to be messed with, and they're damn fierce. Masters had their hands full, for sure. They done camped out at the side door on the right. Won't keep them out long. It's our breeding pen, and most of our bison are in there. They must have noticed us trying to reinforce it and decided it was the best way in. I'll show you the way, but I am done as soon as we see them. They're crazy. Follow me. The 
sick bastards are up there. I'll just hang on back while you take care of things. Wouldn't want to get in the way. Is that coordinates? Steel traps, boys. What do you want? This has nothing to do with you. Piss off, Rangers. You have no say in this matter. We will take what is ours. Then you will die with them.
Nice job you done there, Rangers. And since you're taking care of us, seems only fitting we take care of you. We could send some meat over to your HQ every so often. Sound good? Oh, thank you, Rangers. Any chance you can clear some vermin off the ranch before they go after one of our bison? Well, all sorts of critters find their way to the bison from time to time, trying for a meal. Now, we usually keep them away, but with us being occupied lately, some made their way out back to the bison's watering hole. Can you help us clear them out? Thanks, Rangers. I knew we could rely on y'all. Last we saw, they were out on the ice floe out back. We take our bison out there to drink, so those vermin are a bit of a problem. Well, I'll leave you to it and go tend to the bison. Poor girls need some calming down. You come find me when those vermin are dealt with. <sighs> I feel crashed.
dangers work fast. Thank you for clearing out those vermin. We'll be happy to send you the finest of our bison meat to your headquarters. <laughs> 